Hey everyone, Flying Dutch here. Welcome back to Rome 2 Total War. And we are at war with the Etruscans. We will take their last city on Italia next turn. And then we have to take Alalia over here. We are also at war of Carthage. They declared war. And we are trying to prepare for a war against uh, Syracuse. Which will not be easy. They have some really good units over here. Um, I think my spy can actually go away now because there is nothing to spy here anymore. And maybe the spy can come all the way over here, really. Take a look what is down here. Okay, we have no more money. We don't have to do any more diplomacy. So let's end the turn and see what happens. Okay, Carthage is not going to the, uh, send troops to us at the moment. That is really nice. Okay, we have our first uh, military reform. Maybe we are going to uh, manipular organization. Build some more troops, which will drain our income. Syracuse is also at war of Carthage. And Athens is at war of Epirus. And we have built the villa. So we have now some surplus food, which will give us plus one growth in all the provinces. And we have more replenishment. Public order is okay over here. How is the public order in this state? It is plus three. It's not that high. There is some cultural difference. but um, And we are also losing the cultural race to the Hellenic, the Greeks, at the moment. So we really want to take down Syracuse for uh, cohesion and the spread of our own culture over here. So what I will do is put my troops at the order of the crossing, which is over here. Gonna recruit uh, a bit more units, and then we will go after Syracuse. Uh, this general is not gonna do anything. I, I don't think I can disband the general. Maybe I can do it over here. Details. Not sure. Ah, oh, I can replace. Ooh. We can replace generals. Oh, if I knew that, I would have replaced it. Okay, well, we will make an, a third army at some point, and then we will just replace you. Hopefully for someone from our own faction. But we only have five generals available. I think we have only these available uh, because that are the only characters. General, Admiral, Politician. Can I see the trees from the other factions? I can. You have no one available. Well, maybe not actually. Hmm. Not sure about that. Okay, it's time to go attack Ariminum. I don't think there's anything here. No, there isn't. Blocked. Attack, please. Okay. Now, they will have some ships because they have a port, and the ports have garrison units. And these troop, these units will land, and then they will attack me. It's foggy. Let's not make it foggy. Well, then I will start deployment. Where will their units come on land? I guess over here. We need to take this part over here. We have a good entrance in this area. A lot of battle uh, ground, so I think we will uh, attack from this side. I'm gonna put these ones in front again. Oh wait, I need to go over here. In the bushes. And you guys are going over there. And you there. Start. And move forward. We are not gonna run, and we will do this. Where are the boats? The boats are over here. Okay, if we would have units on this side, we could have taken these out. Oh, but maybe they are going to move towards us. That would be even better. Because then I can wait for them at the beach and then kill them. Oh, 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 oh. What is this? Cavalry. We need to watch out for their cavalry. So let's move a bit back. Let's make sure that we are not going to get run down by the cavalry. Cavalry is very uh, yeah, strong against uh, non-armored units. Okay, they are not going to attack. So we can move forward. 
see what they're gonna do. Are they going to attack me? It looks like it. Missiles awaiting targets. Melee infantry ready. Astarte. All of you should always do skirmish. Run for things you cannot uh, beat. Brave Romans to a man. Our hidden units have Oh my god, what are they doing? Sarge. Really? General! Forward! Yeah, inspire you. Okay, well they are uh, killing all their general units against us for some reason. I don't know why. Holy shit. Yeah, they are running away. Well, then we have some really good shots against them. And move back, please. Okay, they are going to land over here. I want to put, like, a couple of units against it. Okay, they're coming. Our hidden unit. Their cavalry is charging again. Well, then I will charge against it. So been discovered. It's quickly now. Oh, no, they are running away. Let's just attack their archers because they have more range than I do. I think these I'm going to put like two units over here with one of you and these ones need to do this and you need to try to defend from it do it like this the battle is turning in our favor okay they're running away okay they're not landing. Uh, this is a small problem. Because they can attack my javelins. Okay, they're running away. Good. You guys shoot this. Yeah, all of them are running away. Ooh, they flanked me a bit over there. Let's use my general against their uh, slingers. Okay, very good battle. Ah, they landed. The troops landed, so I don't have my troops ready to strike them, but let's uh, move a couple of my units that way. We should kill them very quickly and get a lot of experience. We should get experience level 2. Come on guys, kill as many as you can. And then I will make sure that we are going to kill this. Now they have more range if I remember correctly. I would like to prefer and wait for my uh, troops here. We have 32 melee attack now and more weapon damage because we just uh, ranked up to level 2. Trying to run down as many as these first over here. There are 32 left. Okay, it's time to uh, go over here. Are you still fresh? Yes, you are. This is not good. Because... They are having my range, so let's move forward and just go for it. But preferably a bit spread out. And then you are gonna run. Go! They're getting decimated. And they are running. Uh, let's continue. Let's get some more experience from this group. And then we will end the battle. Well done. Okay, hold. And run them down. Nice kill rate. Really good battle for us. 
that's enough. Quits. Plus 48, they lost 662. Yes. They did. Get wrecked. We will occupy the city. And you are now level 3. Ready for orders. That means that we have a new trade. I can not upgrade one of the existing trades, so we have to pick a new one. Uh, we can pick soldier if you want to. More charge bonus. And we get also more melee attack skill and stuff, so I think we're gonna go with that one, because we don't like marine with this uh, general. So let's get this trade. Nice uh, zeal. He has plus 6 zeal, so he is also doing more damage himself. My faction leader. So it's looking really good over there. And that means that we have all of Italia. And that means that we can get an edict. We can do one edict. Because that is our empire level. Uh, is giving us a limit of one. We can do this. We don't need conversion in this. Uh, here because everything is Latin. Uh, we can get wealth from commerce. We can get food. We can give loyalty to political party ruling this province. We can see that in the overview by the way. But I think it's my. My family. Owner Rome. No, it is part of the House of Julia at the moment. Oh, that's us, right? Yes, so uh, Italia is ours. We are Julia. Or are we Junia? I always forget which one we are. We are Julia with the L. So, yeah. Why is it blue, then? Why is it making it so completely horrible? Because we have red port... No, we, oh no, we are blue. We are blue. We are the blue faction. Not the red one. We are the blue faction. So, that is why I was confused. Blue is our color. So, we couldn't do this. We can do that edict. If we get more uh, loyalty. But we don't need loyalty for our own own party, I think. But what is loyalty? Is that giving us... It's just this number. Can you get loyalty for your own family? And what will happen when you get loyalty for your own family? No idea. No idea. Okay, Spy, you can move over here. This uh, unit needs more armies. Commander. It has 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 Astati and 3 Javelin. I'm not going to build Roaria. They are a lot weaker. They have almost no attack, but they are good at defending. We don't want to defend. Why do you have a penalty to your morale? Do you have a bad trade? Don't see it. No idea. Gonna recruit more units. Let's put uh, like two more of these and maybe a couple of Hastati units. Let's make this army and then we will go and take down uh, Syracuse. It will be a very hard battle, but that is of course the fun of it. Um, are you going to stay here or are you going to move to Rome and prepare for Alalia? I think I want to do this. Next third we will have our next building. Then we can make uh, more boats, better boats. Why is this going down? Oh, the conquest. That's just next turn. That will be over. Okay, food is no problem. Let's spend some money on uh, an upgrade. We can get more wine. We now have 40 wine. We can get 80 wine. We get minus one food, but we also get more growth. And we get more wealth from commerce. So I think it's a good idea to uh, build this. We can also build our villa to the next level. We can get the herding ground. We can go to the grain pits and get more food. Although a farm gives the most food. 
But also gives uh, squalor. Grain pits gives a little bit food and wealth from ag agriculture. And this gives uh, more food and wealth from agriculture. But also public unrest. So. The Horem gives army replenishment rate. Can also be really good. But I think the cattle ranch is the one I want to go for. For the wealth. Let's get more wine first. Can also get more olives. But I think the wine gives us more wealth. Let's do this one. Okay, we are out of money, so uh, let's end the turn here. No, we haven't... Oh, we didn't pick the edict. Oh, really? Uh, the last one is taxation. I will. I think I'll just go for the taxation for now. So we get a little bit more income from uh, Talia. Dalmatae wants to get a trade and they give us money. Yes, uh, sure. I will accept. Yeah, we did the edict. We built some more troops. Uh, my general gets swears like a trooper. More morale, but less authority. Okay. A politician gets cunning. We built all these buildings. And some wars are declared. The clouds in this game are annoying. Okay, let's move uh, to Rome and uh, prepare for an invasion over there. But before we do this, we need to build more boats. And now we have built our um, ship right over here, so we can build better troops. So we have this one as our weakest one. There are only 60 troops on these boats, because it's a B-Rame. I think that is the first tier ship. With a ramming attack that can break an enemy hull, these ships are deadly weapons. These are of course the front line. Um, I think I'm going to build some assault b -rames. Upkeep is... 90. Okay, no, now I want to build like 4 or 5 of these. We're going to need a bigger fleet. Which house are you? A fire pot. Fire pots hurled in onto enemy decks are a terrible threat to wooden ships. These young men are the armored front line. Wait, what? What is the difference? Well, I have no idea, but we can only build three of them. Let's do it like this then. And apparently, uh, you want missile ships and you want light melee ships. Uh, I think missiles are also really good. So you want uh, those boats that can fire things to your enemy. But let's do this first. Commander. Okay, that is done. Are you done recruiting your troops? Yes, you are. Are we going to take Syracuse with this army? I'm afraid. Can I move my spy? Can. I can move my spy over here. Can I see their troops then? Can. These are hoplites. They are pretty strong. We don't know what's over here. Um, let's just go for the attack and see what we can do. So we did have a trade agreement, so they are a bit uh, angry. Oh my goodness. This is going to be very hard to do. They have three armies coming towards us. This is horrible. But let's see what we can do. Let's kill as many as we can. 
Okay, we are just on a battlefield apparently. And not close to the city. I don't see the city at all. What is that? Island? Um, let's move towards higher territory and see if they are going to attack me because they should feel a lot stronger. Control 1. Control 2. Ancestors are watching today. Have a proud tradition of courage, honor, and bravery. Enemy reinforcements approaching. Where? Orders. Okay. We could try to fight them um, the one by one. Okay, they have a lot of these uh, uh, spear infantry. But swords can beat spears. Spears are good against cavalry and defender. They are good at defense. Defense. I think. They only have spear units. I wonder if my Hastati are better against their spear units. I think they are. I do not think they are going to attack me. Let's move a bit over here. Make sure they are not running. Okay, some of their troops are alone. They are very vulnerable right now. Especially when this is staying there. They have no archers in this army, so what we want to do is really is, is run forward. shoot as many arrows at them. Before they attack me with skirmish. What is their range? Okay, yeah, they don't have a high range. It's uh, not that great. What are they doing? They are not even attacking me. They cannot. They cannot throw any arrows against me. So that is really weird. I'm gonna make my line wider so I can start flanking. You guys go in range now, and you also need to come in range. You are way too far behind. They are trying to run away. Which makes sense. Do this. And this. If we can actually land some shots. No. They faked it, guys! No, they faked it! Well, that is horrible. I don't think we can beat this! <laughs> Run. Hold. Shoot. Now they are running away. Yeah, we have to charge in the middle. Let's send one forward. General! Are you not in skirmish mode? You are. It's getting too ridiculous. Let's move back to the front here. And let's start moving you over there. And you guys over there. Do it in slow motion.
You can stay for a bit longer. Charge there. You go there. Our general is under attack. Our general is under attack. Oh, really? And yeah, they're going to use their arches on me, unfortunately. You go here, you go there, you go there. Take that one. You just try to keep flanking these arches away. And my general is gonna go after all these archers. Okay, let's see what we can do. Are you just killing our own troops here? No, right? Yes, you do. They are firing. What are you doing? Can you just encircle them, please? Charge them. Okay, their archers are running away. That is really good for us. Their general is a spear infantry. We need to keep going after this. Don't stop moving. Losing decisively, that's really nice. The enemy general is dead. Really? How did we kill their general? Oh, they have multiple generals, I think. Okay, it's really your job to kill as many things as you can here. Against the archers. And don't fight any spears, because then we will die. Uh, you go there. You go there. Actually, also go over here. That one. It's a slaughterhouse, guys. It is a slaughterhouse. How many troops did you kill? 60? Very good. These are missile cavalry. They are horrible against infantry. Because they can outspeed me and then shoot me. So this unit will just have to be in... Uh, someone to... Uh, that they are going to uh, a distraction, really. I was looking for the word distraction. Okay, go after that one. Still all fighting. Throwing your javelins. You still have ammunition. Kill as many of these as you can. And inspire yourself, I would say. When we can. There we go. And we are even stronger. We cannot fight these hoplites, then we will all die. All our, all our cavalry will die if that happens. You are fleeing. This is getting a bit weak. Let's attack the back of these hoplites. And you just need to try to survive, really. You have no other option than keep charging this, even though you cannot win. Uh, we have to run for the hoplites. Run. These spears are going to kill all our cavalry, so run. Over here. We'll charge this. A little bit of ammunition is left over for these guys. And then they are having no more. They cannot run away anymore, I think. That is really good for us. Charge this. In the back, please.
One of our units has used all its ammunition. Yeah, this one has no more ammunition, so this one is now Yeah, somewhat useless because they are very weak melee wise. Charge them please. We won that battle. Attacking this one. Still a hold over here. Keep running. Yeah, we are getting all kinds of arrow shots at us, so we have to really watch out over here. But we have to use our cavalry against the archers. We need to disturb the archers. They are running away. Then we will also run away. Maybe charge in the back of these ones. You're not doing anything. Go help over here. These are mercenary hoplites, really. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Are these in the way? Yes, they are. If I attack them in the back, are we going to lose our cavalry? I don't think we do. Attacked in the rear, yeah. Does that mean we don't lose our horses? Maybe. Okay, they are running away. Charge. 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 One of our units has used all its ammunition. Yeah, we don't lose any horses, but they are coming with more spears, so run. These units are all done with their ammunition. Only this one has a couple of shots left. And then we have to do it with our with our, all our infantry. Which is horrible, they have too many shooters, they are gonna... Yeah, we are running them in the back now, I think. The men are wavering. Ah, oh, some are going away. Okay, yeah, they are they turned around, so we have to run from the spears. Okay, they are wavering, so that's good. Charge all these ones. Keep running after their archers. Oh, it's getting clouded suddenly. I mean, I must have killed more than they did, right? Let's give you some insp inspiration. Take down these archers. Make them let them, let them run away. You have a couple of shots left. Then we are out of shots. Our men flee the field of yeah, battle. I don't think we're gonna win. At least we are killing a lot of them. I think that is also worth something. I think the spears are stronger than my units then. You guys run away. Oh, not you. We have to keep fighting. What a shame. You cannot run away anymore. Okay, let's play on normal, uh, normal speed now.
Run away from the spears. Our men flee the field of battle. This is a shameful display. Don't let them run away. Just need to make sure we are not getting attacked by spears with the uh, with the cavalry here. We already we already killed two hundred of them. Kill 200 with this unit. <laughs> Holy shit. Yeah, they get an extra rank. They do more damage. This one is getting very depleted. Our men flee the field of battle. Yeah, yeah. We have lost the uh, encounter. Look at all the dead bodies. <laughs> I'm killing more, I'm sure about it. You're very tired, yes, but you're not we're not losing our general, I think. Okay, most of them are now getting most of them are now fleeing. Let me do a little bit more damage here with my general. Is it clear where my general is? This one? Not sure. Okay, now we are losing a lot of men actually. Um, and they are shooting at, 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 at us. I think we are going to run. Please don't die. Okay, run. Said to run. Our men flee the field of battle. This is a show here. Display. They can't fight, so we have, we have to run. And I think when I run like this, we will get some troops. I can concede defeat. Yes. Close defeat, yeah. I think I think that was not bad. We killed 1,200. No, we uh, killed 1,800. And they killed 1,200. So we did more damage. And we get some experience. Of course, a lot of units are completely done. Close defeat. Fall back. Destination reached. Can you... Do you have move points left? No. We only have a couple of these, so maybe we should hire some mercenaries here. What do we have? We have the hoplites. We have Tureo spears. This one costs 500 to keep up. And these are the archer cavalry. I love the archer cavalry. Maybe we should get some uh, mercenaries. Maybe we should get these uh, expensive ones, really. But the army won't die out. Okay, next turn we will see what happens there. Um, let's see, you guys are going to Rome next turn. Yeah, we don't have that much money left. We are building boats. Yeah, I think we are okay. Continue to the next turn. Let's see what happens. Ooh, an Etruscan brooch. I don't like. Research complete. Manipular organization is done. And now we're going to the one that I wanted. 
means that we can now uh, get champions. We have a research raid uh, faction wife. We have that one. We can get champions. Military veterans, they specialize in training troops and arousing military favor. fervor. They can imp impair enemy combat ability, inflict casualties, raid settlements, and rally slave populations against their masters. We could get a champion. Are my boats ready? Yes, but I cannot reach this boat. As if they knew, right? So what I will do is get more boats. Maybe an extra missile one. Let's get this in the fleet. And then next turn we will go and use the fleet to go towards Alalia with this army. Get two more units. Don't have that much money anymore. We could still upgrade something in Brundisium. Uh, the public order is a bit meh over here. But I don't think I have enough money to uh, build any building. So let's wait. Ready for battle. You need to come back to our territory. How may I serve you? So that you are actually going to replenish these units. How can I be of assistance? How and you just keep an eye out over here and see what their army is going to do. Alright, I think that's going to be it. Well. Oh yeah, we are mustering, so I can't uh, do anything. Let's just get more boats. Oh, it takes three turns. Let's do it like this then. And then we will end the episode here. And in the next turn, we will use our boats and our army to go to Alalia. Try to kill their navy. Kill off the Etruscans. Try to take Syracuse and then these two settlements. And then we will have to continue our campaign. So, hope to see you in the next video. And bye-bye. Uh,